NASA officials using the James Webb Space Telescope started studying the most possible places in the universe where there might be life, a group of exoplanets in a star system known as TRAPPIST-1. Astronomers are expected to get enough data on the group of planets outside our solar system in the coming years that they may be able to figure out if other habitable planets exist. NASA recently showed a series of impressive images, including the deepest infrared image of the universe ever taken. But what can be overlooked behind all this is the enormous amount of raw data that the telescope continues to collect. Once it was able to make scientific observations, astronomers began studying the lone star TRAPPIST-1, which has a system of planets. This red dwarf, about 39 light years from the Sun, has attracted astronomers since it was first discovered in 2017. At least seven rocky exoplanets close to Earth have been discovered in the TRAPPIST-1 system. Initial studies have shown that the temperature of some of the planets may be low enough to hypothetically suggest the presence of water. There are other planets close to Earth or temperate climates, but they are usually too far away or around stars too large for us to study," explained Julian DeWitt of MIT. So we have a single window into which we might be able to look at the atmospheres of other habitable planets like Earth, DeWitt explained of the value of these planets. The question we're trying to answer now is, do they have atmospheres? If so, things get more interesting," explained Michael Guillaume, an exoplanet researcher at the University of Liege who led the astronomers team that discovered the TRAPPIST-1 system. Remember that astronomers have seen the future of the solar system, stars devouring their planets. Exoplanets discovered not so long ago are gradually consuming their dying host stars.